everyone. Thank you for tuning in. This is another fun episode. I'm going to show you how to do a tablescape. Um, if it's the first time you're tuning in, I thank you for that. And uh, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, you will see all my social media links on your screen. Um, today, uh, in one of the episodes, I did a, 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 a farmhouse theme. I want to bring that far farmhouse theme now to a tablescape. How would I, I actually would use it in an actual space on a table? Um, I've actually brought in some rental items. I'm going to start with my chargers and my plates. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna start with my black chargers, and then my gold rim chargers. And then I'm gonna go with my blush dinner plates. And then I do the salad. Look how chic that already looks, right? Without too much complication and thought. It's already gorgeous. And I'm going to bring in my florals that I did for my farmhouse theme. The one with the scale. And then I'm also going to bring in one of these, probably get the fatter one. I'm gonna fill it with water. And I'm gonna do florals in that one as well. There might be some residue of whatever. I didn't clean it out when I got it in, so don't worry about it too much. Um, oh my God, I totally forgot what I was supposed to do. The black and white. I totally forgot what I was gonna do. Okay, it's not a runner, it's not a placemat. Just a little detail. I'm gonna do that for four of them. Isn't that cool? I think it's awesome. Yeah, I didn't even think about it. It's gonna make a little square in the middle now. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. And I found these at the craft store, these napkins. I'm gonna do my votives. And you don't have to do them all the same. I'm gonna do some other ones in here. And then I'm gonna do some little ones. And I'm gonna end up doing these votives inside. I have like six, one, Three, four, five, six, perfect. I'm gonna go do, I'm gonna do my napkins. I'm just gonna fold my napkins inside. And with this, I'm gonna do something really, really, really simple. I'm gonna fold the napkin in two. And then I do this. that cheek look it just brought a whole nother level of elegance gorgeous 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 I love when I'm doing something and the, an idea comes into my head because then I get excited because I didn't think about it in the first place and for some odd reason design always pulls together if you have a good eye and you trust your eye, you will be able to create magic. So it's not what I do only, it's what you're capable of doing. So we'll light these candles soon. I need to do the florals on the, on the two pieces. I'm gonna add some spray roses to that. And see, elegant. Do my glassware. 
like this. It's a, it's a tinted pink glass that has a gold rim to it. So starting, you know, you see the stripe, you see the lines, starts pulling it together. And then I'm gonna do my knives. Now these are not perfect pink. They're like a, a, a shiny, they kind of look rose goldish, but they're not. So I'm gonna do my forks and knives and spoons. Apparently we're gonna be eating soup. Okay, there we go. Again, you can have your salt and pepper shakers, whatever you need to do. You know, you might have your water glass, your wine glass. And here, this is those here. And then look at, I think these are really, really cute. Um, these can be your table numbers, okay? Um, it's just a white, it's a black chalkboard. I didn't bring any chalk, but you can put the table number here and you can set it right here. And then these can be your place settings, meaning it can have, you know, Eddie or Grace or, you know, whoever that you need to put as far as your guests. But another way of, of making this a little bit more layered, there's some stickers. And if this is the farmhouse, look at this. Get the camera close up. Aren't these fun? They're little, little stickers. They're used for crafting that you could take and you can place right here. And individual, you can personalize this. So by doing, you have look at how many, you've got the rooster, you've got the lamb, you've got the cow, um, you get the chick, you got the farm. I mean, that's so cute. Like I would take these two and personalize this. Isn't that adorable? I think that's so cute. So let me finish off the florals in here. Light the candles. I'll be right back. Perfect. I am back. Let me put this over here so the camera sees all this beauty. And I'm going to do that one in the front that I neglected to put some flowers. I'm going to cluster it together. Simple and gorgeous this looks. I'm gonna add a couple more spray roses in that arrangement as well. These little, little um, attention to detail is gonna, what's gonna make the tablescape. Look how gorgeous this came out. Let me clean out the table, let me light the candles, and uh, make this all gorgeous. Where's the spider? Look how gorgeous this is turning out. I just love. Look how chic and elegant this farmhouse uh, birthday party, uh, it can even be a bridal shower, it can be a baby shower. Uh, you can use this for many occasions. You can dissect uh, the different things uh, and elements to make it even more funner or less uh, elevated and less uh, elegant. But I think the contrast between the black and white, the pink and the gold, um, the creamy flowers and all the textured flowers just makes this table so luscious and gorgeous all at the same time. Um, if it's the first time you're tuning in, please make a comment, subscribe to my channel, follow me on all social medias, and I want to thank you again one more time for tuning in. Uh, I, my goal is to keep inspiring all of you, and all your comments are uh, it, uh, it motivating me to create even more videos and making it even more fun. So God bless, and uh, peace out, guys.